Hey guys, TD here. Um, time for my sketchbook video. Uh, this is my second render sketchbook. My first sketchbook that I showed you guys was also a render. I will have a link to certain render sketchbooks in the description because I've had a couple people asking me about them, and they are awesome sketchbooks. I really love them. This is a tinier one because I actually draw really tiny. Um, I have a 13 HD Cintiq, a 13 inch Cintiq, so I got kind of used to drawing small, so that other sketchbook was actually really hard for me to complete because it had so much paper space. And I really like this, I can just throw it in my purse and go places, and then I just wanted to do something real quick um, to specify. I technically didn't finish this one, I cut the rest of the pages out because I'm just kind of done with this sketchbook. I'm, I don't want to work it anymore, and... I feel like I should explain why because I've you know had some people like what the fuck why would you run you know why would you rip it out and stuff well I just don't feel like working in it anymore I got a new sketchbook and I have stuff to make another render sketchbook one that has like ringlets on the side ringlets or whatever on the side and I'm going to hopefully ask for like my birthday or something to get a binding machine so I don't have to do it by hand but I just really enjoy, 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 go on, that's great, great start to this, I really enjoy just being able to like flip all the way through, which is why I actually ordered this sketchbook, it's a triangle sketchbook from Holly C. Brown or H.C. Brown on uh, YouTube, because I thought it was really interesting and it's all got different toned paper in it, like she sells these and makes them and I was like, man this is so nice because I can just flip it back if I really want to and I've already kind of started it which is why I'm kind of like done with <laughs> my other sketchbook this one I am purely going to be working on inking with it I like to you know sticker up my sketchbooks but I really want to work on just inking for that one because it's toned paper so I can do highlights and stuff I've decided that like each of my sketchbooks I'm gonna try to I'm actually using it for a sketchbook I'm sorry this part's really long and I'm not doing anything but um, my finished piece, finished pieces that I have on my like normal digital work is nothing like this. I do these really quick just to get ideas out of my head and to like make ideas down. So the actual purpose of a sketchbook, which is why I think I never finished my previous sketchbooks in the past, is because I always thought, oh, well, it's a sketchbook, so I better like, you know, make everything perfect. And yeah, no, that's not how they're supposed to be in. Sticker. I just really like that sticker. I had nowhere else to put it, so started 8-11-2015 and I ended it 10-17 technically today when I am filming this <laughs> and yeah again renders are awesome because they do not bleed through at all and sorry it's like shaky I don't have a tripod this is actually really fast for me to again finish a sketchbook and technically this is actually more pages than my other one was so when I said I was done I'm like yeah no and I've already done more in, in less time than my previous one so yeah uh, doodle page. This is the first thing I drew in here was I was at the beach with my friends and I felt like drawing one of my characters because, you know, beach. Um, sorry about the lighting. Uh, it sucks right now and I wish it wasn't this time, but my lighting in this room sucks. I do like either in the day or at night in my window. Hates me. You know what? Let me try. Maybe I just open it for a second. Nope. Nope. That's worse. And it's hot, so screw it. You guys get the black line. Sorry. This at a party. Um, yeah, I don't have anything like to talk about really, just to show it. I only had a couple markers, and oh, I guess I could say um, starting like, right around here. Yeah, here is uh, I got a brush pen, and so this was like pretty much the whole sketch prep. This was done with brush pen. Uh, some pumpkaboos, print idea. I, I, I'd fix it up, obviously. Just idea, pose practice mini comic idea. Just had to get it out of my head and the layout. Hopefully I can get it done. Print idea. Doodles because I was playing um, Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Cause I, my friend bought it for my birthday last year and I never kind of played it because I was behind on video games so I started playing it and it's really fun. So, uh, Character for a role play with a friend. Uh, trying out my new brush pen. Yeah, like I said, this brush pen. And I make sure uh, that I like keep all of my sketches under like five minutes or so. I try to, like I said, I try to do it fast. That's the that's the sketch. Inking and coloring obviously takes longer, but 
I want to do these just fast as like warm ups for when I'm working on commissions and stuff. So, Rose practice. I hate this one. Love that one. Opal. There's a lot of Steven Universe stuff in here. Adoptable I got from my friend Anna. Ink thing. Some random ink pen doodle things. Uh, don't know what that is. Uh, this is I wanted to actually try watercolor in it and like the paper didn't buckle at all. So these are both done with watercolor and ink. I don't know what this whole page was. So yeah. Uh, did don't know what that is. Uh, I decided to like try to do all of my mages, and I kind of gave up, and I don't know why. For some reason, I gave Tetsu a giant nose in this, and she doesn't have a nose that big. I feel like her hair came out though. Tetsu, Ringmaster, Siren, Adrian, and then Alador's when I gave up. I just like, eh, I'm bored. So I just colored this page yellow because I have a bunch of Copic Wides I got for a great price. So yellow it is because you're yellow. Oh, random list. Uh, Rainbow Quartz, Malachite print idea. Uh, I made a gem sona because I was talking to my friends. They're like, you should make one. And I'm like, well, I like the show. And I couldn't think of anything creative, so I just went with my birthstone, which is the golden topaz, which is as ironic as it is. I, I hate that birthstone. I hate gold. <laughs> I just, I don't like it. I personally don't like gold. I'd rather have silver and stuff like that and blues. So yeah, I was like, oh, she can make shields or something. Oh. Uh, Peridot, attempt, really quick, doodle of Sylveon. Um, my friend was like, make an inkling, OC, so I guess that's what this is. I, I might redesign, I don't know. I don't have a Wii U, and I really want one, so whenever I go to my friend's house that has Wii U and Splatoon, I always play it. Random thing, characters, room, basic stuff. Uh, uh technically a secret character, but whatever, I'm just gonna... Look through this. More secret character stuff. Hurdy, hurdy, hurdy. Yeah, yeah, and I'm not going to tell you guys about that. Uh, character for my friend's story. It's the revamp. I got the Invader Zim comics recently, so I was like, I feel like doodling, and then, yeah, fuck that. And this was originally a dragon, and then I fucked up the coloring, so... Yeah, I don't know what that is now. I call it a gummy bear. Uh, Drawloween, which is I gave up on, honestly. I was really looking forward to doing Inktober, but... With recent stress and stuff in my life right now, it ain't happening, and I just want to doodle stuff and not have to worry about this. So next year I'll probably do it again. I got pretty far. Um, just doodle in my hair. Tetsu, doodles. It was long neck, because I don't know why I felt like just drawing a thing with a long ass neck. Uh, Shovel Knight stuff. <sighs> Forget this Plague Knight, and I don't know what the hell that is, but just doodling stuff. I love how Shovel Knight came out. Again, I might make this into a print or something. Uh, outfit idea for a character when they're older. Bust of one of my characters, Zephyr. This is a, like a, a competition I have with my friend Anna because we don't, we both work. We're both like artists as work, so we both like don't get to draw our own stuff. So she's like, you need to draw more of your characters. And I'm like, you need to draw more of my car characters. So we have this like thing going back and forth. So here's some Zephyr. Uh, here's my started Inktober. I like that. How it came out. Um, Ghost Pokemon for day one. Devil. I, I like didn't have a prompt for Inktober, so I just used the Drawloween one on the back. OC Dove, Inks, uh, Green Goblin for Goblin, because he was my first Goblin, because I grew up on the Spider-Man TV series. Uh, s this character does not look this bad, but I just did it quickly, because for Vampire, he just named him Vampire. Uh, just honestly, I copied this image off of Google, I just looked up like wolves, and I'm like, eh, that works. Because it was wolf, so I didn't. I didn't trace it. I just like looked it up, and I was like, eh. Negative positive space. Eh, it's a bit different. Um, do, 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 do. Pumpkin. I drew my character in the glass pumpkin with little pumpkins. Yeah, this is why. Like, I wish I had a topic to talk about because I don't really have, I like stuff to say about my sketches and sketchbooks because I just use a sketchbook to again. I use them as warm ups and fast things. Um, really shitty perspective practice, because I didn't want to use a ruler, and again, I didn't want to take any time, because it's a sketchbook, so I was like, yeah, I sketched this in five minutes, and then inked it and colored it, so. One house, it was a boo house from one of the Mario games. Character, little mage Adrian. This was done by my best friend. She did Naya. And this is when, uh, you're going to see a couple of pictures in here, and probably the other sketchbook, because they're going to do it too, is we started doing a, um, on our Dungeons and Dragons nights, yes, I'm, yes, I'm nerd. I'm a nerd. My friends are nerds. We, uh, the girls tend to stay when the guys get food, like, because we always like everyone shows up and they go get food, 
And we always stay, and we kind of just do sketchbook trays while we wait for them to come back with the food. So, she did that. Anna did Lily. I did a zombie, because it was getting Inktober. I'm actually kind of proud of how that zombie came out. Uh, character, eating eyeballs. You can't see this. It's not even important. I was just, like, doing really quick still lives while I was at a, my brother's baseball game, or football game. He's in the marching band, so, like, right after halftime, we leave. Some Victorian dude. Mouth practice. Um, I actually, I referenced all of these mouth, mouths from Weird at Midnight on Tumblr.com. It's a kind of a not safe for work blog, but I just love how they do mouths, and I really wanted to mouth practice. So, just referenced a bunch of mouths that they've done. Uh, Peridot for Alien. Raven for Raven. Uh, I almost burned my fucking house down. So there is a story for this. So it was really late at night, and my boyfriend Cody was asleep, so I wanted to light some candles, and I have these kind of candles, they're big, and like, the candle was down to like, here, so I didn't have anything to light it with, so I decided to use an incense stick, and the incense part broke off and hit my carpet, and I like, stomped it out, but then I looked over, and a little bit of it caught fire under my desk, and I kind of freaked out, so I like, stomped it with my hand, and I didn't wake anybody up, and now if my parents see this YouTube video, they're gonna... Realized that I almost burned their house down because I was stupid. And I'm never gonna do that again because I was fucking stupid. Moon did a cracked up moon. A little Frankenstein saying, Fight me. A really, really fast uh, still life thing of a bat. Honest to God, I did this in like under five minutes with the pen and everything. So I did this really, really quickly. Um, sketchbook trade. Dakota did. Peridot. And Anna did. Jasper for me. I drew, for Anna, I drew some guy named Balthier from Final Set Fantasy, and then for Dakota, I drew uh, Iron Bull from, uh, my brain, from the new Dragon Age game. Yeah, this is, here's where I cut it out, and I just, I don't like working on this page. Um, doodling my villager trying to catch a fucked up butterfly, and she's like, fuck, and the butterfly's like, what the fuck? And then I did this little last gravestone thing. Well, I think it's appropriate. <laughs> last page. So I'm actually pretty proud of how that came out, so... Yeah, that's about it. And then Anna's magical work, because she was testing pens on this paper. But yeah, that's, uh, that's this sketchbook. And I am still proud of it, I just... Oh, I was so done, and I really didn't want to work in it anymore. It's so funny, I bought these stickers when I was playing Bravely Default, and I haven't touched Bravely Default since I started this sketchbook. So, but yeah, right now I am, like, on... Shovel Knight, and I'm playing a lot of... I don't know what I was thinking. Like, I keep thinking Assassin's Creed, and it's not Assassin's Creed, it's Animal Crossing. Because, yeah. I uh, just started playing it. Never had it before. Not the Happy Home one, the actual, like, New Leaf. But, yeah. Um, that's pretty much it. Alright, I'll uh, see you guys in my next sketchbook video, which I'm, I'm pretty sure is going to actually be quicker than this one, because I'm just using it for inking practice. So, I'll talk to you guys later, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!